When Eddie Pru was born with a malformed ear, doctors in his hometown of Sudbury said there was little that could be done before he was 12. So the family uprooted and moved to Ottawa, where Chio helped ensure Eddie would grow up hearing the world around him. We have a ghost, a monster. What else are you going to pick? <laughs> Eddie Pru is a regular visitor to the audiology clinic at Chio and a most welcome one. A pumpkin. Loves to interact with the adults here. Yeah. Happy to participate in tests that monitor the hearing in his good right ear. Whoa! Even staying quiet. All right, here we go. To check the hearing in his left, which only happens because of a specially devised bone conduction hearing aid that I'm transfers laughing. vibration. Whoopee. If you plug your ears and talk and listen, you can still hear yourself talking. And that's by bone conduction. Born healthy, but with one ear that did not form properly. There's actually no opening to the ear canal there, so there's no way to fit a traditional hearing aid. Corn. 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 The audiologist that we went to um, told us to do nothing until he was 12 years old. And that answer wasn't good enough for me, so I started looking for um, alternatives and second opinions, and that's when we found Chio. And eventually moved here, uprooting the family to be closer to better care. Nice. We moved away from everyone we love <laughs> for him, and it was, it's worth it. It's totally worth it, but it's hard. It's hard. And expensive, a bone conduction hearing aid not covered by OHIP. It's been explained to me that um, if he was born with a regular ear and needed a regular hearing aid, he would get the hearing aid for free, and absolutely free. The Prue family used a loaner device and then two years ago, a gift from the Chio Foundation. That was his Christmas gift, and they wrapped it in a little box and put a red ribbon on it, and that was his first hearing aid. <laughs> the gift of noise, early and consistent exposure to sound, on both sides. To go 12 years without that sort of auditory input, um, he'd be definitely more at risk for speech and language delays. Uh, when you're really straining to hear all day long in school, by the end of the day, you're really, really exhausted. Eddie not only speaks well with just a slight speech okay. impediment. I like that flower that's on your shirt. Oh, thank you. He talks a lot. He's a chatty little guy and um, He's very social and, like, loves to play with other kids. A happy four-year-old enjoying his beautifully noisy world, thanks to Chio. He's changed my life. He's absolutely changed my life. <laughs> Your continued support makes a difference in the lives of the children at Chio. Please visit chiofoundation.com and donate today.